I'm Carrie Oldham for the Memphis Tiger Network. We're here at the FedEx Forum where the Memphis Tigers opened up their season with an 81-66 win over North Florida. In the first half, the Tigers in North Florida traded the lead, but with 10 minutes to go, the Tigers' offense sparked, and they went on a 30-5 run and took a 47-25 lead into the half. In the second half, the Memphis defense held strong, keeping North Florida's three-point shooting in check and held on to the lead on route to the 81-66 win. Tark Black led the team with 18 points and seven boards. Joe Jackson had 14 points with six assists and six boards. And Chris Crawford netted eight points with four rebounds. We talked to Tarek, Joe, and Chris after the game, along with head coach Josh Passner. Um, just energy. We have been energy tonight, and that's our whole, that's our number one thing that we're focusing on right now. Um, just coming out, supporting each other, playing for one another, and um, uplifting each other while we're on the court. Um, it was just it, it was um, a game that's going to show how we're going to play during the season, especially myself because the CBU game, um, all five guys are kind of perimeter guys in the Princeton offense. Um, a lot of teams we're going to play from, from what I know from my schedule, they're not going to be Princeton offense style um, teams. We're going to have a legit five man. So it was just getting me used to where I'm going to go through the season. Um, in practice, we just we play hard and you know we um, we was vocal in practice and we did things you know that. You know, that was going to help our team win a practice where we set the, set the bar for the team. And, you know, that's, I mean, it was all the decisions of the teams. So, I mean, we just trying to do what we need to do and, you know, be, be a leader out there and be vocal. You know, just a lot more energy. You know, Coach, that's all he's been preaching for the last four or five days. We got to have a lot more energy. You know, that, that, that's what we did. And, you know, it kept like, had a lot of, they made them force a lot of turnovers. You know, we made a lot of open shots. You know, just played as a team and we look good. Overall, I, I, I loved our, our effort uh, today for the first, you know, 30, 30 uh, some odd minutes. I mean, even the first, ha first part of the game, we, we gave up some threes, but that's going to happen. I mean, and we, but we played well. We played hard. We had great energy, really good energy. The last seven, six, seven minutes, we didn't have the same type of energy. Um, and, I, and I told our guys that. We got a little lack, lackadaisical. We didn't finish the game. That's something that we've got to get better at. Get better at. Um, uh, Farrakhan Hall had food poison at you know four in the morning, so I didn't. He, he was IV'd up all day. I didn't know if he was going to play. Adonis hurt himself in shoot around today. He I didn't know if he was going to play. I went in the game thinking he wasn't going to play, so that's why I took him out with nine minutes to go just to you know ice him down uh, to make sure we had you know just to get him get him healthy. So uh, other than that, um, you know overall it was I thought there was some real positives. 47 boards to 31. I thought that was a big thing for us. 20 offensive. I thought we had good energy overall, like I said. And, and you know, we missed some threes. I mean, Chris is a better shooter than two for eight, uh, and he's a better three-point shooter for that. He did a good job defensively, uh, but nine turnovers. Uh, and so, again, uh, uh, there are some good things that we did, some things we got to get better at, but overall it's a W. That's an 81-66 win for the Tigers. We're back here Saturday as the Tigers take on Sanford. For the Memphis Tiger Network, I'm Carrie Oldham.